Hey, this is Virtua Fighter 5 on PS3. And I'm going to be playing some quest mode with Jeffrey McWild. I, I made a mistake the other day. I said I was playing five characters in Virtua Fighter 5 quest mode. And I keep forgetting that I need to up my count after I added Vanessa a little while after the others. So I'm actually playing... Uh, what is this? Um... Six characters. I'm playing Go. Uh, that was a good start to my count, and then I abruptly forgot. Go, Pi, Sarah, uh, Jeffrey, Vanessa, and Wolf. So that's a lot of characters to play. I haven't played Jeffrey in ages. What was I doing? Looks like I was still working on clearing S Club Sega downtown. Almost done. Uh, he's at 9th Dan. Wow. Uh, there's two difficulty settings, normal and hard. I keep it on hard because otherwise the low rank matches are too easy. Uh, I don't remember... I don't have much money. I don't know what I'm going for on these costumes. I, I don't... I, I would need different colors for C. Uh, oh, I did just find something, a combination I like for A. I remember that much. I was kind of out of ideas for D. Well, let's do A for now. Oh man, my headphone, my right... The right cup on my headphones is going out, so I need to... Barely giving me any volume right now. I'm just gonna have to get some new headphones soon. The question is, well, no, I'm just I'll just order another pair of these $30 Chinese headphones off Amazon. They're one Odeo. Ooh, this should be interesting. Uh, one Odeo headphones, 30 bucks, and they, they put out good sound. They put out sound that was just as good as far as I could tell as my old $200 Denon headphones that died after some years, but uh, these have lasted two years, and now one, I won't go easy on one you. headphone is losing it. Tonight. So, uh, I guess two years for 30 one. bucks ain't bad. Ready? Go. The problem is, I would invest in a nice pair of headphones, I guess, but who knows how long those could last? You know, those might only last a year. You never know. All right, so with Jeffrey, the most recent thing I'd done with Jeffrey really was learned his Splash Mountain throw, which is a high damage throw. And the input for that is down forward, down forward, then the throw motion. There it is. So that does a lot of damage. I did also just learn another roll. Yes, he's standing. That one. That one does pretty good damage. That's half circle forward Excellent. motion. Fight three. Ready? Go. I don't really remember a lot of the other moves that I've been doing with Jeffrey because it's been so long. Oh, that was good. Dang. Whoop. Yeah, that's just a boring old low damage throw. Ow. Well, that was a different one. I was trying to do Splash Mountain, but I screwed up. Last time I was playing, I did run into trouble execution problems with Splash Mountain after a while. So, yeah, gotta work on that. But that was, uh, actually that was at the end of September was the last time I played Jeffrey, I think. Oh, yeah. Hard to keep up. Fight one. Ready? Go. <laughs> so right now, I guess I'm just warming up. I don't, probably don't have to beat Alfredo. Party beater, but oh man, I need to familiarize myself. Yeah, I do like this outfit I put together for Jeffrey. These black pants I finally got are pretty, pretty sweet. Okay, 
so that's just down forward. That's not two down forwards. I how did that deck me. Come on. You want to go to Splash Mountain, Eileen? Admit it. See how fun that was, and you did splash. Four four kick. That's the bread and butter. Ready? Oh, what else Go. is there? There's back kick. Oh, oh, that was back punch. There's back, it, back kick punch. I like that chop. You do back kick and then just a neutral punch. Ow. Ah, hey. Circle throw. What are you waiting for? Funny if I slightly Come, unplug. The, uh, the plug for these headphones, Ready? which means that only one channel of the, of the stereo plug or jack is actually connecting. Then it'll send that effectively mono signal from one, one channel of the stereo to, uh, oh wow, that was half circle back. To both headphones, and that comes through at, at full volume on both headphones, so it's some kind of problem the right headphone is having handling a stereo, s right stereo Five, signal, Ready? I guess. Go. Ha. I, I didn't get Splash Mountain again. Oh, come on, Splash Mountain. I'm rushing it, I think. There we go, yeah, I got it. Kind of go just a little slower. That's what uh, double motion moves always kind of worry me that it's going to take too long. Oh, see, he got his off before I got mine on. Good old Final Fantasy Sephiroth. Come on! Oh yeah. <laughs> no, he can hit uh he can hit all three buttons and then and then throw and do a funny throw, but Sephiroth here is not letting me. In fact he's gonna KO me. Alright, that's enough of that screw around. Ready? Go! You Splash Mountain baby! Unfortunately, Jeffrey is, mm, aside from throws, maybe, because he can also do crouching throws, and I, I can't do crouching throws. You have to hit all three buttons, and I can't make that mental adjustment fast enough because I'm an idiot. Uh, aside from the fact that he can do crouching throws as well as standing throws, and he has a bunch of standing throws, Jeffrey's one of the, s probably one of the simpler characters to play, I think. Just big slipper. For the most part. Uh -oh. And really. Ready? Go! Forward forward kick and down forward kick will cover cover a whole lot of ground for you. Down forward punch punch. Fight three. Ready? Go. Oh nice. Oh shoot. Okay, he's doing his katas and I'm not I'm not minding it. Weak throw. Yeah, he did it again. Fight four. 
Ready? Go! Oops. Also, I suppose Jeffrey can do... Oh, can he do... Oh, I missed my chop opportunity. Can he do ground throws? I could look, but I'm no good at ground throws either. So obviously, there's a lot of a lot more potential in Jeffrey than I really get out of him. But uh, even even with my crippled mode of play, he's still kind of strong. Fight one, ready, go. <laughs> Splish splash, Candy Swat was taking a bath. She's only 10th Q. Who am I fighting this poor girl? Because I want that item, I guess. Oof. I don't know. That's a weird throw. It doesn't do that much damage, so I mean, you do get a lot of position out of it by backing them up, but. Ready? Go! It would have to be a very specific use case, I suppose. I mean, it's just not bad to land a throw. But... I didn't do the right one. Oh, Andy, you shouldn't have fallen for a while. You're 10th key. You should have. See, could have done a ground throw. Didn't even try because I'm, I'm done. You're a crouching throw. There's a crouching throw. I did a crouching. That was crouching Splash Mountain. Holy smokes. <gasps> I did a crouching Splash Mountain. Fight three. Wait, is there Ready? such a thing? Come on. Go. I don't. I almost don't believe there is. So there's Splash Mountain. No, there isn't. So what the heck did I do? Wait. No, there isn't. So maybe I just did Power Bomb. I guess. Sure looked like Splash Mountain. Or maybe she was just standing up, but that doesn't seem. Didn't look like she was just standing up. Whoopsie. There's a There's also a... Oh. Now that move is dangerous. Don't really want to do that. I forget what that is. Uh, down forward punch kick maybe? I get... Ooh, I got some kind of clothing item. Fight of Vanessa. Vanessa is fun to fight. Even a third Q, especially a third Q at this point, probably. Oh dang! Fight mm, one. Mm, mm. Ready? Oh, it's Calcillon with that stupid, not fitting right hat. Calcillon, take that hat off. It just makes you look like a dork. Fight two. Ready? Go! Jump. Ooh, ouch. There, oh, no, that's not the hit that I was thinking of. Dang. KO. Down back. I get a down back guard kick. That one. Fight three. That's not a move Ready? I usually do. Go. Oh, that's a down forward. Whoa! Down forward guard kick is that big. And I think I found some combo for that recently, and now I forget it. Okay, why don't I do some good throws? Yeah! Splash and splash. I gotta, gotta come up with a new. Oops. Oh, no. see, crouch, crouching. Uh, uh oh. See, in five, she never follows up with the punches to the face. I have I was just playing uh, Virtue Fighter 4 Evolution, and in that, Vanessa does follow up with the punches to the face. So that move is a lot more dangerous in uh, playing against the AI, AI Vanessa's in Virtue Fighter 4 Evolution than it is in five. 
And I don't think she does it in four either. It's weird. Fight one. Ready? Go. All right. Well, let's get out of here. See what loot I got. And then maybe try to pick off some high wrist. Ooh, that actually might. Garf's emblem. Might be able to add that to the ensemble. Oh, and blue open gloves. So why didn't it say that earlier? That's weird. Uh, yeah. Hmm, I didn't even think of that. Just have white wrist tape. Oh man, that was the final piece of the puzzle. Yeah, cool. It's the thing I needed that I didn't even know I needed. I should have. Well, cool. Uh, so. What you can do is just re-randomize the opponents until you get one without a gold star next to their name. Gold star means you've beaten them. And I'm just trying to beat all the AIs in this arcade. In each arcade I go to. I don't know why it's just a thing to do. But I can't I can't quite beat them all yet because uh what is it, currently only AIs up to ninth Dan or something will challenge me? Let's see how many seconds you'll last. Are um, you ready for this? If, if you run into AIs ranked higher than that from this arcade in a tournament, you can beat them there. But they don't show up in just random arcade floor matches. What am I doing? Oh, I missed the jump again. I keep forgetting. I was thinking about doing some stupid stuff, which is dumb because I should really just win the round. Fight two, ready, go! There it is. That's the come on throw. That actually does do pretty good damage. I, I sort of forgot about that. Oh shoot! Sarah at any rank, she goes into her. Oh shoot! Into her flamingo combos is pretty scary. Boom! And that. Fight three. Hey, stalwart, how do you Ready? like my stalwart? Go. How do you like my black wrist tape? Pretty sweet, huh? Ow. Yeah, see it up close. Ooh. Oh dang it! Sure. Kind of feisty with that kick. Oh, that does really good damage, actually. That's almost Splash Mountain damage. But not quite. I think she's dead. Yeah, she sure is. Eve Ho. Try training next time. Oh. Well, prize emblem. You know I love my emblem prizes. Nothing more useless. What's funny is, in Virtua Fighter 4 Evolution, uh, you know, if you beat a character, like like in this game, if you beat a character, you get their emblem, but in Evolution, you only get... That's the only way you keep... You equip an emblem, like, as far as I can tell, is by winning it. So whatever the latest emblem you won from somebody is your emblem. You can't select from all the ones that you've won, and... Also, I think they only stick around for like a match or two. I never really paid much attention to exactly how long they last, but they just seem to disappear after a while. It's just weird. They, they didn't quite have the emblem thing sorted out. Or I, I although it's quite possible I'm just missing something in the UI where you can go and equip a emblem that you've won and have it permanently equipped or something, but I, I haven't been able to do that anyway. I looked, I couldn't find it. Oh, it's a content fan Eileen. This uh, this is gonna be not so not so fun. Probably. Sunrise. Never seen this AI before. 
Uh, she stood up just at the wrong time, and I'm really glad she did, because I sure as heck was not doing a crouching throw like I should have been. Oh. Excellent. oh, wow, a down attack. And she writhes in pain from me stomping on her ankle, I guess. Fight two. Oh, she clutched her Ready? stomach. I'm not Go. Sure. That's her problem. That's what I meant to do. Oh. Oh. My left headphone just decided to, to kick in full stereo volume. Oh, it went out and then it came back. Oh, man. Left head, or right headphone, rather. Right headphone. Just decide what you want to do. Oh. See, now the headphone has got me distracted. Oh, gosh. She uh, preempted me every time I tried to hit her. Oh, I hate that. That's that's the worst. She's going to do that to me a lot. I'm in trouble. Shoot. I, I totally lost confidence in doing any kind of throw on that character in that in that fight, and that was bad. So all I really had was like a, you know down forward kick and forward forward kick, and then she kept getting in and doing um, you know faster punches and instead of just trying to block and throw or do something, I was, I was just trying to jab her or something, and it was not the right approach at all. Fight one. Ready? Go. I settled for a couple weak throws at the end. Oh, that was supposed to be a splash mountain, but I rushed it. Fight two. Ready? Go. As long as I can get in one Splash Mountain in a fight, I feel pretty good. Did I get one in on... I mean, the other thing the AI does do is sometimes it doesn't play very tough in the first two rounds, and that's kind of what that AI seem to do. Fight three! Ready? Go! He's suddenly gotten tougher. Uh, okay, it's a prize match. I really gotta win this. It ain't just no emblem. Anyway, he's only 15. Come on. Oh, actually, that was a pretty good throw, was that? Huh. Man, a lot of items. A 
lot of straight up clothing on. Oh, do I? Yeah, it's because I don't have a an orb disc. That's why. Well, who's silly? Me. Fight one. But Ready? That is how Go. I got my my wrist tape. So I guess it worked out. Goggles. Well, uh, you have to, actually, I'm not sure I have enough money. Nope. Oh, these things get expensive. They get a thousand more, they cost a thousand more gold each time you fill one up and have to buy a new one. <sighs> okay, well, it's just a good and I can't afford one. Um, goggle glasses. Bonus is kind of staticking on me now. A little bit. Mm. Maybe wear those on a different costume. But they just don't quite look as cool. If I had a lighter look, but I'm mostly been going for black. Maybe on B or something. Yeah, they can work on B, which I never use. There you go. It's good on B. I don't have any custom colors or really anything for B or C for that matter. D, I pretty much finished. And, you know, it's all right. Uh, well. about that move. Back punch, punch, how could I forget about you? Fight two. Ready? Go. Oh, shoot. I maybe it would be fast enough to get in there, but I was feeling myself. It's not a fast move. Jeez. confidence in my throws and my reaction time. I'm just, just sort of blanking. Fight three. Ready? Go! Oh, Shoot, that was unfortunate. Think of that. Garf again. I used to have a lot of trouble with Garf, and I think I just didn't this time because I was not really paying attention. I was just kind of doing stuff. I won't go easy on you. Doing simple Fight stuff too. One. Ready? Go!
Ah, now, I was just uh, told by a, a listener, uh, Cirexio, or a viewer, listener, uh, that Lion is actually pronounced Leon. That's which makes sense that that's how he would I'll be celebrating uh, tonight. phonetically pronounce that as, as a Japanese Fight speaker. One. The I Ready? Go. Lion. Uh, but what's funny about that is, I mean, and he is, his story is, he is supposed to be French. Uh, so, you know, pronouncing, I mean, Leon is Excellent. a French name, right? Or at least it's a name that's used in France as far as I know, but... Fight two. You, you know, they spelled it wrong. I mean, like, there's a there's a Leon in, in what, Resident Evil or something. And they spell that with an E. Capcom does. That probably came out after Virtual Fighter 1 did, but... Or 2. Uh, Excellent. But, uh... So, you know, A, they spelled it wrong, and B... Anyway, it's not it's not quite how it would be pronounced in French anyway. It would be more like Léon or something, not... Uh, not Léon. So, or they don't even pronounce it like they pronounce it like Leon. So it's not a French pronunciation. One thing, it's not French spelling. It's not English pronunciation, and it looks like an English word how they spelled it. So it's just a it's just a mess. And they could have corrected the spelling to an E. I mean, they must have realized at some point. Somebody must have. They could have corrected the spelling at some point, but they, they never bothered, so I don't know. I think that anybody who wants to pronounce it lion is perfectly entitled because it's just a just a mishmash, horrible gobbledygook. But I, I did find, Ready, for instance, a, a clip from the Ready. Virtua Fighter Ready, anime. Ready? Go! Uh, TV show, series, whatever it was, um, where Lion appears to be on, I guess I should say. He shows up in a, in a, like his roles, driving through Paris or something, and, and some secretary or somebody is talking to him about his appointments or something, and he's not paying attention to her because he's doing something else. And like, I haven't <laughs> I haven't watched the Virtual Fighter. Oh, the Bulls headphones are on full volume now, and it's kind of startling. Any SWAT, I already fought you. But anyway, oh, it's a prize match. Um, I could have done a chop after that. Oh. Yeah, so I have not watched the Virtual Fighter anime. I've seen bits of it on YouTube, and it seems pretty funky, but... Uh, seemed like in this same clip, the clip Ready? starts in, it's in Paris, but it doesn't start with Lyon, it starts with uh, a Japanese, young Japanese looking probably guy with short black hair, and I think he's supposed to be Akira, I mean, he, if he's gonna, if he's a member of the VF cast, and it's, it's gotta be Akira, but he doesn't really, I mean, it just looks like generic athletic Japanese guy, young guy, and he's got kind of just a sort of a, sort of short, almost crew cut haircut, so I, I don't know. It's not particularly Akira-like, but maybe it's just a generic likeness, but, uh, and he's also, he's got like a pet squirrel or something that's just sort of perched on his shoulder and, you know, making goofy, big eye Ready? expressions Go. when things happen and he, and he seems to be just going around checking out the sites and he's like really hungry or something so he gets excited when there's like some food I, I don't know it was weird I don't know what's going on I mean if that is a cure he's just a just a kid bumming around Paris with his pet squirrel and he's in search of food I don't, I don't know all right Asgard just put a whooping on me while I was Ready? babbling about Go. squirrels Anime squirrels. That didn't work. Oh, the twisting sound. Well, thanks for the invitation to take you to Splash Mountain, Asgar. I did. Let's, let's just back throw and it's not a good thing. Fight 
three. Ready? Go! That's a good throw. What happened to my chop? Fight four. Ready? Go! Not really sure why I'm fighting Asgard. It just seemed like a thing to do at the time. Ooh. Whoops. It's getting messy. Ooh. I'll take some extra hits. Oh! Oh, I didn't do it. It's fine, it's fine. I win! So yeah, I think I'll just get another cheap Chinese. It's head going it performs well, baby. but uh, maybe they don't Fight last the longest, but maybe they Ready? do. I don't know. Go. And I'll just have to see how, how long the next one lasts. Does it lasts another two years, and that's, you know, two years for 30 bucks for good sounding headphones. That's pretty good. If it only lasted, say, a year, then. It's still pretty good, 30 bucks, but, uh, yeah, I don't know. I don't know. Fight two. Ready? I don't know what to do. I have I have little, little relish for uh, stood up just in time. Just as I pushed Crouch, just as I finally realized I could do a Crouch throw, then he stood up, of course. He was just reading my inputs. Now I, it's got me. Because he stood, st stood still for like two straight seconds, like a moron. Oh, oh, now he's just eating my inputs for standing throws. Hey, you jerk. I guess I shouldn't be surprised. Go. Hi. You know, I'm not sure, Brad. I was just playing Brad in Virtue Fighter 4 Evolution, and I was. Hoping to do some of those cool throws he just did on me, but I didn't find them. I didn't really look, but I'm not sure he has them in 4 Evolution. I guess he probably does. I, but you can't pull up a move list outside of command trainings, and I haven't done his command training, so I don't know. All the headphones going in and out on me again. Yeah, stop your bobbing and weaving so I can throw it. Oh, he's still alive. KO! No more. Well, give me another item. Or some G's, and then I might have enough money to buy a freaking orb disc. There we got the G's. Ah, Calcillon, I've already had the pleasure of looking at your silly hat. Fight one! Ready? Go! Uh oh. Well, that doesn't sound too appealing, but I guess you never know. Let's get that orb disc. There's almost zero chance that a messy ponytail is going to be better than my big fat dreads. Uh, this is at the beginning. Did I miss it? Am I a moron? Yes. Why do I even have to ask? Ugh. See, heavy dreadlocks. I mean, come on. That's pretty. That's pretty good. Oh no. <laughs> Well, 
take a look at it. But it doesn't look good from any of those angles. Messy ponytail. What the heck? Definitely running out of opponents. Uh, oh, there's still a bunch. Come on. Those, those do. Okay, I guess there aren't many more than that. Yeah, see, I don't think this person is going to challenge me. And that person definitely won't. So I guess it probably is just these two low levels. Got a 10th Q and a 9th Q. Well, they got to show up sometime, right? Actually, they don't. Sometimes they just don't. Just have to come back in another session or something. Oh, hey, hi, Spike. Where you been, man? Don't pull a Spike, yeah. Yeah, you just disappeared for a long time. Default costume. This'll hurt you. <laughs> oh my gosh. Uh, Ready? Looks like he's got a black squirrel on his head or something. Bad. There's a, there's a black Davy Crockett cap. Davy, Davy Crockett. Spike does have that chocolate bar emblem, which is pretty sweet, no pun intended. Ready? But I'm Go! pretty sure I think somebody in the even lower lower level arcade has that one. Not even really paying attention to what I'm doing, which is not a good way to go, but let's get some splash mountains in at least. How do you like that spike? I just spiked you. If I spike him hard enough, he'll go to Splash Mountain. Did go to Splash Mountain. Of course, there is a mountain stage in the game that you fight on. It's all snowy and cool looking in this version. I like to think that's Splash Mountain. Try training next time. Spike, goofball. Yeah, where was he all this time? He should have been training. <laughs> Argentina is all Akko Spork has to say. For, uh, Spork? Akko Spork. Yeah, that's good. Uh, so wait, Spike was 10th Q, so I'm looking for a 9th Q. So it's definitely not Akko Spork. Go. Get the chocolate bar. Oh, darn headphones. Alright, we can get that ninth Q to come by. Calcillon and Garth again. Retor again. Doing Splash Mountain kind of messes with my wrist somehow. It's the repetitive down forward, down forward. I don't know. It shouldn't be. P 
Poot Waddle for the bajillionth time. to Blue David in the next arcade. He's a real jerk. He's a, wait, is he? He's a ninth Dan Leon. And man, that guy is no fun to fight. Not looking forward to that. Oh, sweet black armor. I'll be celebrating tonight! I mean, I'm, it's almost proper ninja armor, except, of course, it isn't because it's all shiny and glistening. Not exactly blending in. Also, all clanky, right? That would make a lot of noise. It doesn't make sense, Blue Ninja. The only thing blue on you is your little ponytail holder. Oh, come on. You want to go to Splash Mountain? You sure do. Ready? Go! Oh, I shouldn't have tried to splash mountain right off the bat. I guess he's got blue shin guards or something. Didn't see that coming, did you? She's only ninth Q. Right? I shouldn't trash Go. talk to a ninth Q. Oh man, I gotta take this dead animal off my head. Hey! Oh. You stood up at the wrong darn time. Oh, yeah. It's a forward kick, I think. I meant to do a jump kick, and I got the timing a little too close. Well, that probably does it for, for downtown, for now. I'll have to go up at least another rank, I think, before that ninth Dan would come along. Penicillin. One. Ready? Go! I got, I got a little rank up in this session. Uh, so, okay, I've got to take care of this business. I had a feeling that was not going to... not going to be what the look I was going for. So, the next in rank, so, uh, Sega Arena Coast is the beginning arcade, it calls itself. This one is beginning and intermediate, and so I've completed, I've beat, I've fought everybody in those two that I can fight. So, next comes intermediate, and that is Club Sega Bay Area, with its irregular spacing. I wonder how many people here I've fought. I'm kind of surprised that two out of the first three here I've already beat. I mean, I've, I've obviously done some tournaments here. Fight one. I'm kind of surprised Ready? that my Jeffrey got to ninth Dan, not even having finished the first two arcades off. That was pretty good rank up. Oh, come on. Come on, Plague. You want to go to Splash Mountain. Plague's got a pretty cool outfit, I must say. Oh. Oh, I didn't. I rushed the Splash Mountain. KO! Fight two! Ready? Go! See, it's funny because you can you can whiff the big elbow at the beginning and they'll still get hit by the follow. That did a lot of damage. I hit the carries moves. Dang it, I rushed the Splash Mountain again. There we go. KO! 
Fight three. Ready? Go! Akira is kind of a chump in Virtue Fighter 5. Oh. All you really have to do is block and wait for him to do a big whiff. I'm not good at being patient, so sometimes I manage to screw that up. Not enough this time, though. Not enough for Plague to beat me. Only first Dan, but I just hate fighting Leia Faze. Fight one. Ready? In fact, Go! I also hate this stage, so let's just see if I really need to fight this guy. Oh, I do. Binkley Coon. <laughs> Hopefully we at least got a better stage. Oh yeah. This will hurt you more than it hurts me. Fight one. Ready? Go. Whoops. Dang it, rush the splash button. Oh no. Uh, trying to slug it out with a wave is a bad idea. KO. Fight two. Ready? Go. Oh, that was not what I wanted. Sheesh. Yes, you can totally do the elbow early, and they still won't block the follow-up. It's weird. See? He should have blocked. He should have seen that coming. But I guess I wouldn't necessarily see that coming either. i think, oh, he missed me with his elbow, and then <laughs> every time it would get me. Oh, I didn't get the stagger follow -up. Ooh. Oh shoot, I forgot about that. That wasn't so bad. I <laughs> see liked how his face was right in front of the, the big electronic sign. I made a, make a decent thumbnail. Good contrast. Gosh dang it, Mizumi. You don't get to rematch me. Fight one. Ready? Go! Just because I came back once. Oh, we're oh, late. All right. Do some more. Just a little more, though. I got started too late. Did that say Virtua Junkie from the Arctic? I think I've seen this guy before. Oh, the monocle. Fight one. Ready? Go! Take that in the monocle. Excellent. I love the cape because it just goes over his head all the time. <laughs> Fight two. Ready? Go. Oops. Oop. Okay. Okay. Let's tighten up a little here. Ooh. Ah. 
I just done it. I could have landed a normal throw there. Uh, now he's got me second guessing my throw selection. Fight three. <laughs> and Ready? mumbling into the microphone. Go. Darn you, Lao VF. Darn you to heck. Oh, what? Actually overestimated the range of that move. Oh, I rushed my Splash Mountain. Uh, uh, it's fast. There we go. Splash your mountain. Ooh. Sassy. Now we're getting orbs. That's what you need the orb disc for. You get seven of those in your little orb disc, and it does this big, crazy animation, and you get a special item. Which tends to be sort of weird face or head items customized for your character, or, uh, or like a different colored tans, or... I like that jacket dance. I like those glasses too. Actually, I really want those. Why does not my go have those glasses? Why am I speaking in semi Shakespearean Yoda talk? Excellent. Because I'm a moron. Fight two. Ready? Go! Ooh. Oh. Don't deny the Splash Mountain dance. Should have had one there. Shoot! First time back punch punch really failed me today. Well, that's right. If you if they block forward forward kick, sometimes you can get in a down forward kick follow up. Uh, and nail him. Ready? Go! Let's try that again. Four forward kick. He blocks. Oh, he did. But he, he kept him guessing. Kept him blocking. Huh. Oof. Of course, sometimes it just hits him. Oh. Oh, nice. Oh, shoot. Watch out. I do win. Sure didn't win in that tournament, but tenth and Eileen, yeah, I'm not not good again. Eileen's Eileen's freaked me out. Oh, I made him switch costumes. Eileen's actually freaked me out. And they're always flipping in the air and jumping on my head and slapping me this in the face. You fall down. Yeah, that is a pretty That's bad one. backup costume, Ready? Chuck. Go. Chuck, you gotta have two decent costumes, and that is not what that is. That is an abomination. Oh, oh, come on, roll with it. Roll. Oh. oh, I screwed up. I got greedy. Oh, I rushed my. Oh, no. Ugh, took a step in the wrong direction there. Fight two. Ready? Go! Man, back punch punch it. They're onto it. Oh, he did. Oh, no. Chuck, how can you do me like that? Oh, shoot, he teched his Splash Mountain. Okay, Chuck, you're asking for it. You're asking for a lot of splashing now. Oh, shoot. What the heck? He did that right out of. Oh. Okay. Okay, Chuck, this is war. Gonna beat me in my own splash mountain game. Oh. That's all, Chuck. I mean, there's one more round, but I was getting tight. Fight three. Ready? Go. Ooh, the headbutt. That's what I was thinking of earlier. I, I don't remember how to do that. Oh, no, that was a side throw, maybe. 
Hey, Chuck. Ooh. Oh, good one. And sidestep. Couple kicks. Follow up. Chuck just put on a clinic. Oh, no. I gotta... I gotta learn how to tech this. Oh, I did it! Uh, suck that, Chuck. Oh, shoot. See, I forgot it's two punches. I got caught by that. And I was trying to punch my way out of that. Oh, oh no. I'm dead. Dang it, Chuck. Fight five. Oh. This is what I need, though. I, I do need definitely to fight more high ranked Jeffries. Oh, jeez. He's blocking everything now. Okay, let's just get some throws in. I want to do it again. Oh, man. See, I can't evade because I'm a chump. Ah. I gave away too many rounds. Took Chuck lightly. But see, that's the thing where they do, I swear they go easy on you sometimes in the first two rounds. Okay, can't let, can't let this, oh, there's his, oh, he switched me because I challenged him. Oh, Chuck, Chuck, I hate you now. That is a definitely, definitely better looking costume though. See, that's the, Oh no, that's costume A, that's right. That's not C. It's actually a pretty Oh, but he's got he's got the wild ponytail or the whatever ponytail was, the messy ponytail. Chuck, something died on your head and stuck there. Fight two! Ready? Go! Ah, dang it. Yeah. Try to do your weak throw on me. Okay, this is where Chuck's gonna come on strong. Got it. Oh, wow. I don't even know what that was exactly. Mountain. Oh, there's the headbutt. Oh, that did so much damage. Shoot, see, I forget it's two hits. It would get me every single time. Oof. Now that's Mariner's power. Yep, orbs, orbs, orbs. Oh, five rounds. Oh, they're short. Oh my gosh. Well, it's gonna. I hate these. I hate these goofy rule tournaments. I can't. I can't do them. Dan, where did they get you from? So this is one of the... Oh, no, this is different arcade. Well... Fight one. Oh, sweet Ready? outfit. Go. Well, I guess I'm glad I came because that is an awesome outfit. I wish I had a black bra on my Vanessa. Got me, I forgot. Fight two. Ready? Go. Time's up. Fight three. Ready? Go. Oh, shoot. Enough. 
Well, there we go. Time's up. Yeah, that is an awesome Vanessa outfit. I gotta remember that. Fight four. Ready? Go. Uh oh. Cost you all. Fang Shui. Oh no, Blue David. Wait, did he get beat? No, he didn't get beat. Dang it. Maybe he will get beat, but I doubt it. Oh, Blue David's here. Probably gonna get past this jerk. Yeah, that's not what I wanted. Shoot. Jeez. Fight two. Ready? Go. to do in that situation. Fight four. Ready? Go. Dang it. Uh, I can't. I'd have to be patient to beat this guy and there's no time. Time's up. Uh, I mean in theory I could be patient. I just have to defend. I can't. Stupid rules. Oh, dang it. Well, see, this is another match where I really need to be patient. And the time this setup does not really want me to be patient. Aw, oh, come on. Fight one. Ready? Go. Oh, no. Oh no, you jerk! Gosh, dang it, of course Ready? it did. Go. Ew. Same thing's gonna happen, I bet. Yeah. Time's up. <laughs> dang it, he did it again! Fight three! Ready? Go! I mean, I get one Splash Mountain, but then there's too much time left for him to get in his next attack. Not enough time for me to get in it. Well, he screwed that up, so that worked out. Fight four. Ready? But if he gets Go. his attack in... It's still more time than I would like. Oh good. Oh no. Well, it doesn't matter. Fight five. Ready? Go. Okay. 
No, he's got way too much time now. This is danger. Oh, he screwed up. Now he doesn't have enough time. Time's up. Fight six. Ready? Six. Go. Oh, headphones. Hang in there, headphones. Don't distract me now. Not when I've got Velenkamp in a good position. Time's up. <laughs> Ready? Go! Oh, too close. Oh. oh! My headphones are going nuts on me. Time's up! Poof. Well, third place. Now that's Mariner's power! Got a little dough. All Blue David lost. Yes. Kind of worth it coming just for that. And that Vanessa costume. Well, that is all the time that I managed to give myself tonight. So, all headphones just kicked in when that clonked into place. Yeah. I got to go to Amazon right after this and order another pair of headphones. And if they last another two years, that'll be great. Um, so, kind of, kind of rusty with Jeffrey. I feel bad about that tenth Dan Eileen I lost to. I did get the first two rounds, but then just blah. Um, other than that, I guess I did all right. Cleared out downtown. Got some. Got some decent wins in Bay Area, so it wasn't it wasn't terrible. Jeffrey, as I said, is pretty. You, you can play him pretty darn simple, and he's strong. So uh, yeah, not so bad. Now the next character in my Virtue Fighter rotation is Vanessa, um, but of course I I should play some other games before I do some more VF five. Uh, what would I play next? I've been kind of itching to get back to Darkstalkers on PS1. Uh, just because it's kind of a cool game. It's, it's got slow down. It was ported not by Capcom themselves, but by Cygnosis, uh, a British developer. And apparently they had problems with it, and it took them... It took them like a year longer than it was supposed to or something, and it, it has a lot of slowdown. Uh, not a lot, actually. I shouldn't say that, but it's got some. And in in a Capcom fighting game, you don't usually expect to have slowdown. So, so I think Capcom was not too thrilled with that. Um, they uh, the next Darkstalkers that came out on PS One was Darkstalkers Three, and they ported that one themselves, and it it has much smoother frame rate. Uh, it doesn't have as much activity in the in the backgrounds, though, that's kind of one of the fun things about the first Darkstalkers on PS1. It's got these really lively backgrounds. It probably is what added to the to the slowdown, but uh, I don't know. Maybe that's just a, a, a trade-off Cygnosis felt they had to make. Um, and I don't know if the... I should look this up, I suppose, if the, like, the arcade versions of both those games was there less animation in the backgrounds of Darkstalkers 3 than there was in Darkstalkers 1, uh, also known as Vampire Savior at Darkstalkers 3. Um, so, uh, you know, Darkstalkers 3 is technically the much better port on PS1, but uh, there's stuff. There's a lot of stuff in Darkstalkers that I, I find endearing. Um, and I'm playing those on PS1 because... Darkstalkers or Vampire normally has a red screen flash when you when the final KO is made in a match uh, the whole screen flash is red it's just one flash and it's not really that bad but I've I've dedicated myself to not playing games with red screen flashes like that because um, they're not not great for eyeballs uh, 
especially my eyeballs. Well, not especially, but that's that's how I feel about it. Uh, so, but the PS1 versions, for some reason, just don't have those red flashes, so that's good. Um, that's why I'm playing the PS1 versions. So that may be what I do next, Sharkstalkers on PS1. Maybe I'll get some other hankering to do something else tomorrow. Who knows? You never know. Um, but uh, I'm glad I got some Jeffrey in. He's, uh, he's just fun to play in this. I play him pretty simply, and he does a lot of damage, and... I should have looked up the headbutt, although ne I've never really been that good with his headbutt. Uh, but it's a pretty cool move. I mean, that... What was Chuck? Was it... Was that his name? The... the uh, what was he, like, 8th Dan? Jeffrey, who took me a couple tries to beat? He laid some pretty good headbutt combos on me. That was impressive. I, I wish I could fight him more. I wish I could just pick him out and keep fighting him. I suppose I could... Uh, wait, if you... Be, mm, no, I guess not. Mm. Anyhow, uh, yeah, so thanks for watching this. And uh, more, more fighting games tomorrow. And there's probably some fighting game videos on my channel that you haven't seen yet. So uh, maybe, you know, check some of those out. I have tons of Virtua Fighter Five. Uh, videos, lots of Jeffrey videos, uh, you know, whatever. Or not, that's fine. Um, okay, but that's it for me for now, so good night.